The car was speeding at 90 miles per hour. We want this in feet per second. Oh boy, let's look at this. We got 90 miles per hour. Let's look at all the conversions. Let's change the miles into, I did want it in feet per second first, right? Yep. So we want feet now. And then we'll look at miles. There's 5,280 feet for every one mile. That'll cancel out the miles. Let's look at the next conversion factor for hours. That's a bad line. We have hours, let's compare that to minutes. One hour is as good as 60 minutes. Now we've canceled out the hours. But we need to cancel out the minutes as well. So we need minutes in the numerator and seconds in the denominator, which will cancel those. And it's 60 seconds for every one minute. That's great, because now we can just multiply these numerators and each denominator as well uh, what the heck does that give us all right assuming i didn't make any mistakes there we can cancel out these zeros and we got 47.52 divided by 36 which will go into 47 once so we got 36 there uh -oh, 115 let's look at multiples of 36 right, that'll do that part for us so three Minus 108, and we got a 72. Oh, that's good, twice. So what is that, 132 feet per second. FPS would be fine as well. Like if you said, I just wanted, let's convert this into feet per hour. You could have just multiplied those two first, found out what that was, and then done the time conversion there. So that's a great question.